Hi guys, Nate Dodger here. Welcome back to the Revive server. We're using the Revenge of the Sea Team mod pack. It is Sunday. I hope you guys have had a fantastic, fantastic weekend. I have been busy once again in here. I've had to do a bit of work. I've went and got... Oh, hello. Bit of lag. I went and got a load of iron. Um, had to get a load. Um, I've been smelting some... I've still got a stack in there, but I've been smelting up... Um, this stuff here just to get more iron because I've been making a lot of iron bars because you can see I've got 46 in my inventory still and I've added a load more downstairs in my sort of laboratory area because I learnt after doing a little bit of research and finding out the hard way with this I don't know if you saw Jimmy's video but um, Jimmy found came over here and he found that the stego had escaped and he found that this whole area had been decimated it had been destroyed the stego had walked through um, and basically, the Stego seems like he can uh, he can do what he wants. He can just break through anything that isn't that is that is weaker than iron. Um, where's that zombie? There's a zombie dying out here somewhere. Hello, dying zombie. But um, yeah, they can break through. So I have to come in here, and I've read the same the same thing with this this guy. He does exactly the same thing. I've moved the the door. Hello, are you okay? Are you going to come and kill me? Aren't you? Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. You stay there. But yeah, he will. Um, he will do the same. So anything weaker than iron, I'm hoping iron bars count. And I'm hoping this jail door doesn't get broken. If it does, I'm going to have to put um, an iron door on here. And I may be safe and put an iron door in. I don't know why the, the game's lagging so badly. It's very weird. Um, but yeah, so I've, I've literally encased this in iron bars. I'm hoping that does enough because he grows to seven blocks wide. Seven blocks wide. I've made it one block wider as well each way. So we've got nine blocks in the middle here. I think we've got one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, nine blocks wide. I'm hoping that's enough to keep him, um, to keep him, to keep him contained, and he won't break stuff. As you can see, he's a little, he's a little fast one. So um, yeah, I'm hoping that will be enough. If it doesn't, we're going to have a disaster on our hands. This will all get broken. It'll all get smashed up. The quagga is doing rather well. Have I got any food on me? No, I haven't. No, I haven't. I have also doing some research on, uh, on the next the next item, and it is nearly done. Look, it's the mammoth DNA. I've already lost another cultivator doing this this morning when I was when I was sorting out stuff and getting getting these these cages sorted. Um, I lost another cultivator, a culture vat rather. Um, but this one is nearly finished. So I thought what we'd do, rather than waste time messing about out here, we would try and get a little cage for the stego, because he needs somewhere to live that is safe for him, that isn't going to break. Um, that isn't indoors, because indoors clearly isn't going to be an option for him. So I'm thinking we build some kind of little cage thing out here for him. Um, and yeah, and we see how we go. So I'm going to just put a load of iron bars down here. Once I've broken enough of a land for for that to happen, I'm going to make it quite large. I don't want to be, I don't want to make him pen him into a, a too small area. I'm going to run out of, of iron bars, obviously. But that's why I've got so much that I can actually... I can actually smelt up and and use myself. So for now, we'll just make it this big, um, and we'll see how we'll see if this is big enough for him. Um, there we go. Right, so that's going to be his little cage. Yeah, we we can expand. We can get it wider if we need, or bigger if we need to. So that is what the plan will be for now, just to give him a nice little, nice little area he can live, um, and hopefully get him in here, get him on a lead, which I should be able to do. Bring him in. And hopefully that will keep him. Uh, it'll keep him, keep him inside, and keep him, keep him happy. Bless him, because we don't want him destroying everything. Um, I'm a little concerned that the Ceratorus is gonna, gonna do the same thing. To be honest, but we'll cross that bridge when we, when we come to it. These flowers as well. I'm thinking I should be able to use them to feed him. I'm wondering if you can, if plants like that work. It'd be really handy if we could. Right, I've run out of iron bars. Let's go and get some more. Um, hopefully then we can get some food as well and we can get you guy, you little man inside, back inside the base back inside somewhere safe a couple of uh, high iron bars to start we should do it it doesn't have to be loads, I need some food badly really badly need some food because I cannot sprint anymore that is bad please let me sprint, I need to sprint I can't run, need to run um, right, I also need to claim some more chunks don't I to stop people like Jimmy just coming along and uh, and stealing stuff. Well, let's just grab a let's just grab a stack of these out of here, and put them in there. And we'll grab the iron bars that are here. We'll let, let, let this ferris um, do its thing as well quickly. The ferris is a byproduct of iron. When you when you pulverize iron, you get ferrous, which is always useful to have. You never know when we're gonna maybe need it. I don't know. 
Let's make some more. We've got tons. We've got we've got 64 there in a bit, haven't we? Have we got any more food? I think I gave all my decent food to uh, to the dinosaurs. I think. So we'll have to munch on some carrots for a bit. We can go get some more wheat from down down in the farm at some point. It's no big deal. But for now, let's just make some more. Um, let's just make some more of these. What am I doing? Whoop. What are you doing, snake? Really? Is that all you can do, is it? <laughs> right, let's just make another... I won't make all use all the iron. We'll just make another three. There we go. So we've got another stack and a half there. That should do for a bit. Hup, hup. Let's go and uh, make him an out. Oh, I should have got the lead as well, shouldn't I? Let's get the lead while we're here. The lead should be in a chest somewhere. Should be, should be, should be in one of these chests. Lead, lead. Oh, no, it's on me. I've got it on me. I've got it on me already. What are you doing? Hup, hup. There we go. Right. Let's get down here. Before he goes and walks through the base completely and lets out the the, the Ceratosaurus, Ceratosaurus, and everything. Who's this? Is this Jimmy? Missing someone. I last saw him down by the river. Well, it's all right, Jimmy. He's come back. I thought that was Jimmy, yeah. Um, he did mention to me that he'd... Before he went on holiday, Jimmy's away in Cyprus at the moment, so you'll be, hopefully you'll be watching some of his old, some of his videos while he's away. Uh, right, let's hope that two bars is enough for him to not escape from. There we go. Just go all the way down here, and we'll drag him in through this door, and then eventually I can uh, I can I can put a I put an actual jail door on there or an iron bar, an iron door or whatever. They can go on there. I'll have to be careful when I put the uh, him in here because I know he'll escape straight away. But I need to make sure that I need to make sure the um, the gap is big enough. There we go. Right, we're nearly there. There we go. Right, it's too high. So let's see if this is enough to get him in. And then we can then we can put the. Um, we can hopefully put the other bits of bobs on there, put the other iron bars in quickly before he escapes. Excuse me, would you like to come with me, mister? No, you, you don't don't want to come with me, do you? Because you've lost your lead already. Where's your lead? Where's your lead? There it is. Right, come. I know, I know, but you're, you're dangerous. You're dangerous. Come on. This way. This way. Come on. Oh, lead's broken again. Oh, you're going to be a pain. I can get the, the old stick thing to follow, can't I? But it doesn't seem to work very well. You're just going to come down from there because I think that's the problem. Come on. Come on. Down. Mister. Come on. This way. This way. Follow me. Oh, broken lead again. Oh, you're a, you're a troublesome one, aren't you? You're a troublesome one. Come on. Come on now. I can't even push you. Pushing you doesn't even work. Come on, this way. Brick lead. There we go. Oh, you're awkward. You're awkward. Right, does the drum... Shall I go get the drum? Shall I try the drum and see if he'll follow me? Because I don't think the stick seems to work. I don't think the stick seems to work. Right, let's get you a drum. Let's see if your drum... See if the drum will do the work. Oh, you're getting bigger, aren't you? You're getting a lot bigger. Right, let's grab the drum. Bomb, bomb, bomb. Right, let's get the drum. Then we're going to need a mammoth. The mammoth's going to be the same problem, isn't he, as well? The mammoth's going to be exactly the same problem. Right, let's put this down here. Put the drum on the floor. Let's put that in there, actually, because we need... Oh, no, I need food. Flowers, there we go. Right, drum. Follow. Are you following me? Oh, is that now... Do I need a stick now? Is that what that is? Is that now I need a stick to make him... Follow me. Maybe that's what it is. So the drum literally beats out the, the the order. Then the stick is the thing that then makes him follow. Is that what that is? Let's try that. Let's quickly go and grab a stick. Let's see if we can get him in there. Because, I'm, like I said, we need to get him contained. And we need to make sure that when the Ceratorus um, is, is then fully grown, he will be contained as well. Because otherwise, we're going to get ourselves in a world of trouble. A world of trouble. I probably could have gone the other way, really. But it's okay. Right, let's get back down. See if the stick then does the job. See if it works. Hopefully it will. We can get our lovely friendly Stego contained. Come on, mate. You're, you're sort of heading in the right direction. Right, here we go. Come on then, quickly. Before it's night time and I have to contend with a load of mobs as well. Stay. 
No, I don't want you to stay. I want you to follow. Not free move. Stay. Follow. Come on. Why do I... How do I... What do I... How do I... No, can't do it. Right. Um, I don't know what that means. Right. Is that not... That's not... I don't know. If you guys know how that works, please let me know. It'll be very useful to me. Don't sit down. Whatever you do, don't sit. Right. <laughs> he sits on my head. Come on now, please. Just this way. Look. Just, just over here. Look. I know I've got you on a lead before. Why can't I do it again? I know. I know. Can you please come down from there? Please. Come on. Please come down from there. Please. Please come down. Come on. This way. Can I, can I pull you this way then? This way. This way. Come on. Don't be awkward. This way. Come on. Oh, you're a pain. You are a pain. This way, maybe. Come on. This way. Why don't you want to come? Please come with me. I don't want to have to order you to... I don't want you to stay. I want you to come with me. Why does... How does the stick... What do you need that isn't a stick? What What else can you use to make to make them follow you? Because the drum says follow. The stick says stay. And that's not what I want. Where's your lead gone again? Where's your, where's your lead gone? I've lost your lead again now. And now I have no lead at all, by the looks of things. Is that the lead? Did I just see the lead? Nope. Didn't see the lead. Where's the lead? Oh, look, I've lost the lead now. Lost the lead. I've got the dodo. Yeah, the dodo, guys. The dodo was, was born. The dodo was born. It's now getting night time, which is bad, which means I may have to leave him out here for the night while I go and do some other stuff because I've now lost his lead. His lead is now gone. You're not. You're being very, very awkward. If you're on the ground floor, I could pull you along, but I can't. So, it's very, very annoying. I have, I have, what? Don't know what happened there. I definitely haven't got the lead, have I? No, I'm just looking. It's definitely not on me. Right. Come on now. Come this way. This way. Come on, over here. Well, listen, I'm going, I'm going to have to go back in and do some work. So, you just be good. Don't break anything. Thank you. We're going to see if the mammoth DNA has uh, done its thing. Mammoth, oh, mammoth embryo. Okay, so maybe we need, I don't know what you do with the embryo. I think you need to, I need to work out how you do that. Um, do, let's do another dodo then. We'll get another dodo doing its thing. And, oh, don't throw that away. How do you, what do you breed with a, I don't know. Right, let's get the dodo in, um, let's get a dodo in here with this guy. Oh no! Sorry, Dodo, get in. No, I didn't mean to. Didn't mean to do that. You get, you get acid. Phew. Right, you get in there. Are you warm enough? Are you, are you, are you warm enough? Let's just quickly see. Um, Dodo, he looks cute, doesn't he? Dodo, he's just a Dodo, right? I need to put some um, lights in here, don't I? Really, I need some torches in here to make it a bit, bit better, a bit brighter. Let's put one here. You all right? Quick. He's very cute, isn't he? Derek the dodo. I don't know. Uh, another stone brick. And there. And there. Perfect. Right, there you go. You stay there, Mr. Dodo. You look after him, Quagga. All right, I can't now get out now, can I? Because I can't get out now. So I need to just quickly put those back there. There we go. Sorted. Right. So you just be careful by the door, okay? And, uh... Yeah, you, you leave them alone, right? They are, I know they're meat and all that. I pull your tail. I pull your tail. Um, just be careful, right? Because you're going to be big and uncontrollable soon. You'll be a nightmare. So um, yeah, just be careful. Right. So we have more. Has he come down yet? Has he come down off of his? No. He just seems to like it there, doesn't he? He seems to stay there. He seems to enjoy it. We've got a nice pen now. Look, the pen is there, but. Mm, it's not good. Right, what else can we do? What else can we do? I need to eat some more food, that's for starters. Eat some more food. I need to research how I do the embryo. I don't know what I use. How do I breed that? What do I stick that in? Is that a horse? Put it into a horse? I don't know. I don't know what you put it into to make it to make it uh, give, give birth. 
I need to look into that, find out what, what animal I need to breed, or use to breed the uh, thing with. So what I'm gonna do while we're here actually, because I've been planning on doing this for a while now. Let's, um, have we got, how much room we've got? We haven't got a lot of room, have we? Um, I'll tell you what we'll do then, we'll use those jabber barrels there. We've got, we've got six here, we'll put these in here. I think I had some more, did I have another one? Yeah, another one there. And then we'll take some of this stuff out. And I'll put this stuff back in there and uh, there. What else have we got? We've got some tritanium and some so tritanium and silver. And we'll grab all of this as well if I can. There we go. And put that in there. And that's not because that's a carrot. That in there. That in there. Uh, that in there, and we've got that one there. We need one more to put in, so I'll just break all of these. Put some some uh, bricks back there then, can't we? Some stone bricks back behind these bookshelves. So that is all back to where it should have been. There we go, sorted. We have a nice wall of them there. Could possibly go up one more, actually. We've got three more, haven't we? So let's just do that. One, two, three, and we'll put them up there as well. Sorted, right, that's good. Get some stone bricks and put them, fill this in. There you go, perfect. Perfect. There we go, stone bricks away, cobblestone can go away. Perfect, sorted, sorted, sorted. Right, has this all finished? 64, no, it's one. One has been done, we'll take that out for now. We don't need that. I've still got to sort all this stuff out because it's such a mess in here. The aluminium needs putting away, doesn't it? Such a mess, right? Aluminium, boom. Is it becoming morning yet? No, it's still night time. Stego's still sitting there. Lost the lead. Have we got another lead in our in our chest anywhere? Let's just double check that we haven't. So if we haven't, I'm gonna need to make another one now. Or we'll do some research as to how I get him to follow me. It may be the wrong it may be the wrong dinosaur completely, I don't know. I'll have to find out. Uh no lead, right. Let's get another lead. So how do we make a lead again? lead it was just string and slime wasn't it that's right so we should have enough to make that somewhere we've got some string king slime frying pan we must have enough string surely I've killed so many spiders yeah there we go one two three and one slime perfect perfect let's do that make this quickly uh, that's not what I made it with is it Oh, I need, need four, missed that. Um, there we go. There we go. Boom, boom, I made two leads. I must have had a... What, it's there! It wasn't there! Honestly, it wasn't there, was it? Is that just me? Was it there? <laughs> I don't know, right, I'm gonna go to bed and then I'll come back when it's morning. I'll be back in a second, guys. Right, it's morning. Let's see if we can get the Steggy down to where he should be. Hopefully, none of these guys will bother me. Look, all this has been destroyed. Look where he's he's come along. Hello. Yeah, you're dead. Right, there's no creepers or anything around here, is there? There's a witch, though. I think we might need to deal with the witch. And there is a creeper there with a lovely hat on. Right, you're not going to poison me, are you, witch? Because you're very annoying. Right, you're, you're finished. And you're dead as well. Good. Right, sorted. Okay, so we need to get you over there. How are we going to do that? Are you going to follow me down now? Are you feeling more... Nope. Are you feeling more cooperative today? You're not, are you, in any way? This is so annoying. It's so annoying. So annoying. Come on, I'm going to have to punch him to get him off. You know what? That sounds horrible, but I'm going to have to, I think. Can you get down? Go on. Oh, he's... He doesn't even move. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I thought I might that might knock you back. It didn't, did it? I'm really sorry. I'll, I'll make it up to you, I promise, I'll make it up to you in, in your, when you're in your new house. I'll make it up to you. Um, I'm sorry. You hate me now, don't you? You do. I could, I suppose I could break the, stop it now. I could break the ground that he's under, I suppose, and make him fall. Oh no, 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 sorry. So I, I didn't mean to hit you again, I really didn't mean to hit you that time. Oh no, oh no, it's your head, blimey. Right, come on. Can I, can I do this, will this work? 
Will this work if I just dig along? No. <laughs> I didn't mean to! No! No, that's... <laughs> All that's left is some stegosaurus meat and some bones and I feel so bad now. I feel really bad. I feel so bad. Oh. <laughs> oh. Um. Yeah. Well. <clears throat> yeah. I'll get another one. I promise. You won't. <laughs> oh dear. Um. I think it's time to go, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I'm now a stegosaurus murderer. <laughs> oh, that was... No, that wasn't intended. Rest in peace, Stegosaurus. Rest in peace. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll be back with some more Avenger the Sea Team soon. <laughs> Bye.